In today's news for you, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and humans are not the only ones who fall victim to this disease. Dr. Wendy King is with Spears Creek Veterinary Clinic, and you've got Coco with you, who is sticking out a little tongue. But you brought Coco for a reason. Mm -hmm. um, first of all, breast cancer in dogs? Yep. They I did not know like, they got it until you told me that. Just like people do. Uh -huh. And I brought Coco here to kind of um, give an example of it is, is actually, I think you guys can see that they have actually eight, eight mm -hmm. um, memory chains in there rather mm -hmm. than just two of them. So right. they're, they're two, much more. Four, with, and sometimes yeah, they two, can, four, six, eight. And sometimes mm -hmm. they can have ten. Okay, mm -hmm. so which increases their chance of having of, it, mm -hmm. of getting breast yes. cancer. But the big thing that I want to make people aware of is that breast cancer in dogs is almost 100% preventable. It's 99.5% preventable if you'll just spay the dog. It's almost always female dogs if you'll just spay it before her first heat cycle. Oh. I don't want people to panic if they miss that first heat cycle. It still is beneficial to do it before the next heat cycle, it just drops those numbers to about 85% less likely to get breast cancer. After that, there's not a real big benefit for breast cancer, but there's always a benefit for spaying them. They can't get uterine cancer, or ovarian cancer, things like that. How do you detect it? How do you detect it? Is Coco here was spayed when she was a little bit older because she is a rescue. So her mom goes through once a month and just, just feels it just like you do, just like people, just to make mm -hmm. sure there's no lumps, bumps, anything like that. It's not painful to the dog, so it's the owner that's going to have to find it, and it's usually a firm lump in there. The problem is, is that 50% of um, mammary tumors in dogs are malignant. 90% of mammary tumors in cats are malignant. And then as far as treatment, do you go the whole chemotherapy, radiation route like you do with a human? You can. Most of the time, if you catch it early enough, you can actually get wide enough margins where you can just do surgery and and get it removed we always do take x-rays of their chest to make sure it hasn't metastasized but again you emphasize if you are if you will get your dog spayed before the first before heat the cycle. first heat cycle you you nearly wipe out the chances mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. getting the breast yes. cancer exactly can we get a tight shot of coco sticking out her tongue <laughs> i don't know can you see this little mouth this little tongue Coco, thank you for being our guest. Dr. Wendy King is online right now at WISTV.com slash 4 p.m. And we'll take any pet care question you have. She'll stay with us till 4.30. And if you'd like to see this interview again, follow me on Twitter at Dawn D W I S T V. Also click like on my Facebook fan page, Dawn D Mercer Plank W I S T V. You'll find my daily interviews here and especially this one with great information. Dr. King, thank you as always. Go online if you want to talk to the doctor.